I am Purple Mantequilla, and we are continuing with Oxenfree 2 Lost Signals. I am putting up the content warning link again, and I'm reading it out loud. Nightschoolstudio.com forward slash content warning. If you need to check if anything in the game that comes up will ruin your good mood or ruin your day, no problem to back out. But please don't mention to me what it is that's making you not want to hang around because I have not clicked that. I have no spoilers coming up for me. I don't know what what could happen. Um, but it's totally fine if there's something it warns you about that you're like, I'm not going to be happy um, waiting for it to happen. I'm not going to be happy if it does happen. So no problem. We are going to carry on. I got stuck. Um, I think I overthought what the the um, EMPs were. I thought you had to find four and type in the number for a year on each one. I did check because I was stuck. And it isn't that. I think it's more like a tuning in the radio thing to different channels type thing. So we stand by, I think, we stand by the the rupture that we we made because we went in there and it was just green and it told you a date didn't it i think if you change the number going in there takes you to a different version of the same a different time of the same place like you're tuning into different time zones of the same spot and we need to tune into a time when the mine was open so what i was thinking yesterday was we needed two more of those things so I could do the first box one, the second box eight, and then the other two for whatever the year is that the mines were open. And then my phone just vibrated. And then we could go in and it would be what we want. It turns out it's not that. We just needed to tune it in randomly and one of the points is going to be the one we need to go into. So I didn't spoil myself. I just like, what is that? What is that thing that I'm stuck with? How is that particular thing working? And it was just me overthinking. So that's my thing. Getting lost is my thing. And overthinking is a close second. But because I'm referring to my map so much in this playthrough, I didn't have that. So the overthinking is number one for this. We are going to jump in. And wish me luck. Oh, by the way, it was lovely of that person to stop by and chat. It was lovely of that person to follow. However, I don't want you to come into my chat and try and sell me anything, please. It's, it's, it's distracting me from playing. Chat is supposed to be a conversation and not me trying to politely say, I don't want to be your customer. I don't want to see your portfolio. Can you not? Okay. Right, let me grab that sparkle. Riley? Oh! Are you there? What do you want, Olivia? Over. I saw you losers walking in. But you totally didn't notice me. Oblivious. Caught up in your own crap. No one and nothing else could possibly exist. Oh yeah? How'd I look? Old. I tried to get some replacement tech off those... Uh, Whatever the hell they are. It's all bolted together, so I broke it instead. But look, you have no idea what you're trying to, like, prevent. You can't stop the weather, it's the equinox. You know what that means? You know that thing you saw in the sky? To you, it's the ocean. And you're trying to build a dam with twigs. It's a waste of time. And it won't work. Uh, I don't know if you've ever heard of beavers, but... Listen, I'm gonna save you some trouble, because I know you're just dying to say. You think you know everything, but you're young, and blah, 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 vomit, choke, die. But here's my secret. I know that I don't know everything. I don't know how ketchup works, so save it. Uh, there's not much to the condiment, just tomatoes and sugar. Probably some food dye. Go put some tomatoes in a pot and sprinkle sugar on top. See if you make ketchup. My point is, I know one thing. One Needs thing vinegar sure. too. I know what I want. I know it. And I know I can get it. And I think that's a lot more than most people. Do you know what you want, Riley? 
think about that. We didn't have that last time. God, what an annoying person. She didn't radio us I last time. Or maybe she did and I didn't Sorry. answer it. Right? Let's hurry it up. That's so weird. Hmm. Uh, Heritage was trying to recruit Maggie Adler? We did pick that up last time. Okay. Yeah, we did we did get that. That's that's strange. We didn't get that radio call. I can't remember. Maybe she radioed by didn't answer in time. And that's why we actually got a conversation this time. Okay, this is how my mind works. I just remembered something. Knock knock. It's open. It's open who? Or wait. Damn you. <laughs> we didn't have the joke this time. To the... Never mind. This is some kind of equipment. Uh, I can't tell what it's monitoring. Huh. Is it uh, on or working? Whatever it is? I don't think so. Nothing's, you know, lit or whirring inside. Wonder what that cable is connected to and what it's for. Riley, answer. Come on, manners. What? What is it? Maggots and mildew. You notice that's all that stupid town Garland is? No wonder it was abandoned. It deserved it. Yeah, that that's most of the world, kid. It's unfaded disappointment. But no, it isn't. Most of the world is the ocean. I like your vest, by the way. I could never find one I liked. That wasn't like ten thousand dollars. Suddenly you're nice? I'm actually always nice. You're just on the other side of it. But normally I'm a plate of pancakes. It's a shame we'll never be friends. I mean, aside from the fact that you're like 50 or whatever. They tell me you're dependable, reliable, have a big heart. Whatever that means. They say you're a real peach. I'm not gonna answer. It's too bad. I can never find anyone who liked vests as much as me. Maybe in the next life, you know? Maybe then all our dreams will come true and look great doing so. Maybe. Two calls from her. Maybe you don't get the second one if you don't answer the first one. That's weird. I'm getting replay differences when it's not even a replay. I've just had my own little time glitch from not saving. Check it out. Another one. The last one was helpful. Maybe whatever's inside, this one will be too. Or uh, whenever's inside. Okay. Why are there so many uh, wires, cords, cables, whatever, leading into that building? This isn't open still, right? No, no way. And they look, uh, fresh? Sure, we'll, we'll call them fresh. Either someone was here recently, or someone is here presently. Jesus! Okay, they took our picture again. Hey, if you're in the post office and you're a human being... No, pal, I'm a turtle. Sorry to disappoint you. Did you break my equipment? Over. Uh, no, wait, what's all this stuff for, exactly? Over. Name's Hank Chapman, and I just took your picture. Assuming you were facing the camera. Otherwise, it'll be the wall. Well, aren't you the lucky one? I usually charge for headshots. Over. That flash wasn't meant for you. Listen, I'm an amateur hobbyist investigator of the inexplicable. And I don't know if you've noticed, but tonight has been... The professionals would likely call it unusual. Around town, I've set up a series of EMF boosters. Equipment I use to capture, well, let's call it evidence of the unusual. Something's been screwing with them, so I need them checked. One of them is outright not responding. I'm assuming the worst. Can you help me out? We said no last time, and I think it made no difference. Sure, you got it. It's a good deed for messing up the picture. Think of it as karma. Now, there's a generator in the post office with you that powers the boosters. Think of the EMF boosters like a safe. Put in the right code, you get to see what's inside. If you spot anything, maybe snap a picture. If 
if you can. I'll make it worth your while. Call if you have any trouble. See you in the obit. Over and out. I think he's talking about this thing, right? It says EMF on the side here. You think this could help us? Yeah. You know, Hank seems like a, I want to say a nice guy, but these EMF booster things, it's a fun pet project for him, but unless they're going to help us plant this transmitter, I say let's ignore it and try the mines. You know? Well, I don't know. We'll see. I don't want to... Andrew Rhines, Postmaster 1878 to 1903. Must have been the first. Huh? Oh, right. First postmaster for the town. I said yeah, they ignore it last time. Hang a picture. And we did it anyway, so... Wow. Kind of got some Teddy Roosevelt vibes. He looks more easy going, though. Oh, here we go. I uh, think that came from outside. Tragedy. Twelve lives claimed in deadly mine shaft Hello, collapsed. Topanga. Latimer Mines no longer in operation. Garland mourns its greatest enterprise alongside twelve cherished sons. Ugh. From 1892. I guess that's when things started to go downhill. Topanga's on yep. camera. Yeah, Miss Topanga. Good girl. Pink mentioned grabbing a picture. I've got my camera with me. Garland Post Office, established 1878. Okay. Um, we got transmitters. Hank wants to use his booster things, get a picture of something, maybe something living. Okay. So we got uh, some numbers here, or digits, I guess, on a dial. Just, yeah, careful, etc. Careful, etc. Right. Okay, so we that got the same. The Did I have it on number two last time? We got the exact oh same thing as last time. Amazing. Riley, this is amazing. Look, like Mother Earth, man, she is no slouch. Smells a lot better, too. Yeah, I should have just left it alone. Oh, this is much better looking than any hardware store. Most hardware store, sure, but I've seen some liquors. You'd be surprised. Right, now we can go back. We had to we had to climb down in order for it to activate so we could go back through. Okay. So it's caved in over there. And okay. that was twelve something. Uh, we know they're affecting the time tunnel, right? So, so I think it's just a matter of getting the right time that the uh, the cave's open. Yeah, and what the mine? Look, you can see the the thing changing the as I'm flicking through it. This. Yeah, I think we're on the right track at least. So but let's just keep trying. I was fixated on it being, I have to write because there's four holes there, the full year, but you don't. So if we go in now. Is this 18 something? Oh man, Riley, check it out. Ooh! 18. I guess it used it to is 18. A campsite before it was a town. Okay. Okay, so it isn't the year. It must just be a frequency then. Still caved in. Mm. 
19. It should be caved in then, shouldn't it? But let's do it. So that's there. My God, take a good long look. I know we got a job to do, but like, this is unbelievable. Wow, like a postcard. Garland in its prime. Where is everyone? Maybe it's nighttime, uh, there too? Let's look around. Hmm, mine's closed off in this time period. But yeah, still closed. It had to be open at some point. Yeah, okay, this one won't help us, but we have to be able to get to a point when the mine was open. It was like this entire town's job for years. Yeah, let's keep trying. It's not, ah, now it's there. We had to wait for him to say that, okay. Now we can do it. I wonder what the one up top is for then. Because it's not. A, maybe another tear's going to form there. Sixteen. So it can't be. Oh no, it is years. Sixteen twenty. So it can't be years. Oh, maybe, ah, uh, maybe I do need to, ah. Uh, maybe I kind of had the right idea. Maybe I kind of had the right idea, but I was doing it wrong. Eighteen. What does that one, what number does that one give you? Maybe I had the right idea, but I didn't quite put my finger on going it, jumping into the thing. That's the thing that's taking you to everything 20. Yeah, it's panning down to show me. Oh, uh, this is my bad. I should have I should have worked that out. So it wasn't built yet or it was already caved in. Oh yeah, look. The building is there. Eighteen seven let's do eighteen seventy something. The building changed down there when I was flicking. Okay. I didn't notice when you're changing the numbers. I was so focused on the numbers. I didn't notice when you changed the numbers. In here was changing. Not been built yet? Not been built yet. Okay. Okay, so ch change change it to an eight. Probably would have been simpler to just memorize dates, but. That's all too much. Right. Let's try again. No. Don't need to do that. Okay. Eighteen eighty. Hey! Ah! Oh, awesome! It's it's open. See? Phew! Whew. Glad that paid off. Yeah. Man. Okay. So you can tell I didn't cheat because I still I still had to work stuff out. A 
and now we're back in our time anything oh, actually before we do that anything over here no okay This is a random question, but what made you move away? From uh, Kimina, I mean. After high school. Uh, I don't really remember. Just the feeling, I think. I wanted to get away. Something like that. Just the feeling. Everybody wants to go to heaven, but nobody wants to die. I don't know why I keep thinking about that. Maybe because, as a kid, I wanted to be treated like an adult, but without growing up. I'm sure most kids feel like that. I want to stay up all night and do whatever I want, but I don't want any bills to pay. Well, uh, I never wanted to grow up. I never wanted the responsibility of making decisions. I always wanted life to just happen to me. It's sad when I can't anymore. There's just something about Garland. How the town just couldn't keep up with history. It must make me babble about all this stuff, because I never left Kamina. And sometimes I wonder if I should have. My life would be really different. I wouldn't be here, for one thing. Hey, maybe you should have. You still can, you know. Yeah, I know. If we, uh, survive whatever's happening right now. I, the way they just fling themselves at big drops like that. Just, I want to say thanks. Thanks for letting me help tonight. This feels like the most worthwhile thing I've done in a very long time. I'm sorry to cut you off, Jacob. I've got to say, I'm not connecting and caring about these two the way I connected and cared about Alex and Jonas. Oh, hey, I think, I think this is it. Great view, right? Sad city, great view. Mm, you should work for the tourism board. Clearly you have a gift for slogans. That'll be my backup plan. You know what? The top of the chapel is the better bet. Higher, less obstructed. Let's do it. Come on, climb time. Who can I hear? Hello, are you talking to... They're under the sofa having a conversation. Whoa, cool maneuver. If I tried that, my spine would fall out of my body. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Oh, uh, sorry. Do, do you smell that? Uh... Can't say that I do? I didn't smell it before, but... That's rot. That's... Whew. Oh, that's bad wood rot. Yeah, hurry up and stick the transmitter uh, so we get... Ah! Jacob? Are you okay? God. <laughs> he just fell through the, the bottom. Do I, do I... Do I fall down with him? Jacob! Can you... Can you hear me? So we're not seeing the transmitter doing anything? I've placed a transmitter. Can we tell her? Oh, I'm going down, apparently. It's Evelyn, isn't it? Ah. Evelyn? Come in, Evelyn. Just... Please. Over. Jacob? Jacob? Please? Say something. Oh, he Make went. Noise. He fell down a lot. He's dead or got two broken legs. I'm almost there, Jacob. Just, just hold on. What are you doing? What are you doing, Tapanga? <laughs> Topanga's up to mischief. Topanga was just doing a sexy dance against the footstool. 
yeah, Topanga's in heat, and um, she was having some sexy times against a footstool just then. <laughs> Did I break something? Oh! Oh, I should have still been going. I thought it was a load screen. Still. Okay. Jacob? Where are you? What, what, what am I looking at? I'm lighting candles. Woo! Okay, you can, you can just stop, okay? This is, you know, superfluous. Am I doing something wrong? Shall, shall I go for a different candle? No, that didn't make a difference. I am just full of hate right now. I hate you floor. I hate you air. I hate you hate. <laughs> I'm doing other things. Hello, Topanga. Oh, Topanga's gone to lay down near Remy. Oh, I can't. I can't get the radio on. Ah. Um. Yeah, my adventure's running around on the floor. I can't now see myself. There I am. So we just have to keep doing the, the um, we have to keep doing the candles. Or maybe I need to carry the candle with me. Back here. No. Okay, so maybe we just got to keep on doing the candles again and again and again until it stops resetting. Because it's not the radio, it's not the walkie-talkie. It's not not doing the candles. It's not taking the candle and running around with it. Maybe it's an order. Maybe it's a specific order. Okay. Right. So we got that one. Do that one. That one. And that one. Perfect. Ah! Green girl. Green girl. Alex, is this, is this you? 
No. Die. Out. Out. Door. Impossible. So. Time. Alex, stay away from him. It was an accident. What are you doing? Alex. Alex? Girl. Lost. Beach. Care. Not dead. Boys. And. Green. Girl. Take. Oh. 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 He keeps dropping. Alex, stop already. What is this proving? Door open. Why does she think Door. it's Alex? Why would Alex do this to them? And Oh god, just let me be able to fix this. Jacob, Jacob, can you hear me? Wow, this is new. Oh. I see. I see you. Just, 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 wait. Oh, the board gave way, didn't it? Oh. Jesus, how did you survive? You dropped at least a couple of stories. I'm uh, not entirely sure. Probably time weirdness. It didn't feel like that far of a fall. It's like I just taken a header off a chair or something. Are you okay? I mean, like you look okay, but still checking. I'm not the one who just fell through the roof. Yeah, but you know, manners. <laughs> God, Miss Adler would be pretty pissed at me if she knew I'd broken into this church. She uh, always said not to wander around Garland and get a disease. Sorry. Let's, uh, let's get out of here. Can we just do that, please? <sighs> All right, let's head up, close that portal and finish this. Oh, I did. I did think I pushed climb, but there we go. Okay. I don't get why she thinks it's Alex. I don't know why she thinks it's Alex. I don't think it's Alex. It doesn't sound like Alex. We just played as Alex last week. <sighs> okay. Okay, okay. We're back. Let's plant this thing before anything else. Before a horde of gremlins drag us off into the night. All right, watch your step though, seriously. I'm not climbing down there again, even if you yell really loud. I don't blame you. And after the transmitter's planted, that should be it, right? The portal should close. With any luck, at least. I'd say we're due some. I'm quitting, by the way. First and last day, that's today. I never thought I'd miss the service industry. After tonight, waiting on miserable families sounds downright refreshing. Okay, so we're not... Able to call her. Not able to call any of them. 
We heard that. Ren's uncle. Ren's uncle. Did we close it? Uh, did we do it? It seems better, right? I think so. I think we did it. I think, I think we really did it. I just, I, I, I can't believe it. Something about this just feels too easy. Why would Alex, why would she just, I don't know. Why are you insisting if we beat that them, it's her? It's not like they rolled over, but... They didn't roll over. We shut the door on their ghost asses. Look at this guy. You see any portals? Hear any weird voices? Feel any time distortions? Because I certainly don't. Okay, Jacob, you're just a little too happy to have barely scraped by and only possibly succeeded in saving our past and future lives. Hey, I'm taking the W. We won. <laughs> Let's enjoy it. Yeah, he's optimistic. God, probably like four in the morning. There's a lot of stuff to sort through, like what to do about. Can't call Evelyn. Happened. But I don't know about you. I think we earned the rest of the night off. I mean, the storm lifted. Or right? at least yet. We should go to the docks. See about getting you a hotel. I'd offer my own place, but I don't know. You saw it. Not exactly pristine. Honestly, Jacob, I just need a damn couch. Hey, you can use mine. I just have to... I, I should clean the uh, cover, though, first. I accidentally spilled gasoline on the, uh, the uh, cushions and some citric acid from a project, but... Never mind, never mind. That's, that, that's okay. I caught a hotel through the school. If the walkie works, the phone might. I can call a ride. Sounds good. It sounds back this way. Let's get rambling. Okay, so we've got a little save icon. They are leaning really heavily into this is all over, so we're probably far from finished. Right, can I, can I tell her now? There we go. I planted the last transmitter, Evelyn. You on the horn? Riley, can you hear me? I'm in the car. I finally got my car started. I'm, I'm on the road. Sorry I can't pick you up. If I get too close to the coastline, the battery starts to drain again. Over. Oh, where are you going? Over. I left work and I'm heading to my partner's place. She's been home for a bit. Uh, 
my sister never called Riley, and I still can't get in contact with her. I took your advice and told my mom the truth. I think it was the right thing to do. But I'm just, I can't be at work anymore, because it's just work. That's what it is. Work. And my family's my life. Even though tonight was really exciting for me. And you were a big part of that. Thanks for the readings, Riley. I mean it. This information will help so much if anything like this ever happens in the future. But right now, I just have to... I just want to be home and wait by the phone. If that makes sense. Over. Okay, Evelyn. I hope you hear from your sister soon. Over. Thanks. Okay, Riley. If you still need anything, feel free to call. I'll be on the line just in case. See you later, Jacob. Hope you find your doggy. Thanks, Evelyn. Take care. And good luck. Over and out. I'm hearing honking, so I was wor I was thought we were going to hear an accident. As so we can't climb that rope. Uh, Jacob, what's going on? Jacob? Jacob! Hey, what are you doing, man? Did you get a little, uh, deja vu just now? Uh, wait, was there a... Oranges and lemons, say the bells of St. Clements. Here comes a candle to light you to bed, and here comes a chopper to chop off your head. What's... what's going on? I thought the transmitter should have... Oh, that late, I... <laughs> Is Alex? But look, this isn't what I'm here for. Back in Garland, when Jacob was affected in the time loop, that wasn't me. It was them. I said it wasn't her. The crew of the USS Canaloa. They've been using the half open gate to pierce through timelines and talk to Olivia when I wasn't. I told her we were done, that this wouldn't work, that it shouldn't work, but. She has a determination in her that the Sunken are taking advantage of. The Sunken? Those people that first got trapped between time? How are they back? What do they want? What anyone wants, what anything wants, what I wanted. To live, Riley. To come back to our timeline no matter what it breaks, and no matter who they have to take over to make it happen. They've convinced Olivia to go to Edwards Island and use the comm tower to open another portal. They're gonna consume everything and everyone they can to reconstitute themselves. The way I wanted to do it was a clean swap. This will be more like a hostile takeover. Everyone in Kamina is in danger, and you're the only one that can stop it from happening. You and Jacob. All right, well, you're helping us. I don't know how or, you know, but you need to help. Of course, Riley. I can't let Olivia do this. Okay, we're out of time here. Now, get a boat. I'll see you over there. I guess it was just... Wait, what happened? Was Alex here? She, she, she was she was here, and then she said the, the sunken are coming back? Is that... Yeah, and apparently we're all in really deep trouble if we don't prevent them from popping out of a new portal Olivia's trying to open. We need to find a boat and get to Edwards Island. We were so very close to being in our own respective beds. 
So close. So close. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know. Okay. So oh, sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. Done long night expecting weird dreams. Don't know what to say to Jacob. Never mind. Olivia's insane going to Edwards Island to stop her. Hank is still... Has, has his note there. Okay, our map is all... All drawn. Need a boat to the island. He tells me we need a boat. Is that right? It's a, I'm still a little foggy. So, uh, that doesn't leave a lot of options. Hey, you wouldn't be against us just a borrowing one from the docks for a few hours, right? I feel like this is worth the less than completely ethical way we're going to go about it. Yeah, yeah, let's just do it. We don't have a lot of time here. There's always a few boats tied to the pier down here. And, you know, since we're going to Edwards Island, this is kind of it. Any loose threads? No, it's kind of the time. Not that I'm stalling. Loose threads? Is there a loose thread I'm missing, Jacob? Hey, a lot of weird stuff happened tonight. And I'm just saying, if all goes well, this whole harrowing experience is done after we get on that boat. So anything you want to do before it's done, better do it now. Okay, okay so, so not... here's not exactly track a block but So we're doing the little do? boat? Oh, small boat. This looks fine. Yeah, here to there is all we need. It's Ava's. She runs a bait shop. She always tries to get me to go with her to field test new products. I guess so she could feel less guilty about fishing on the clock. Dude, she was totally flirting with you. I mean, clearly she had t-ball level game, but still, that's a proper flirt. Hey, Jake, let's go skewer some worms. That's when I knew we were meant to be. <laughs> it's padlock to the dock, and we need the key to start the thing. But I bet all the coins in my pocket that the key's in the shop. And knowing Ava... The door's probably unlocked. No, it's exactly itching to steal leeches and mealworms, so. Okay, so we need a code for the lock and a key for the boat. And hopefully some calm water after that. Come on. Wanna use this? Yeah, I, I, I do not, and neither do you. Edwards is way too far out. This would take light years. We need something with a little more, uh, seahorse power. Oh, it must be a seafood restaurant. I'm like, isn't this the bait shop? I'm just looking at the crab. Knew it. No one secures their damn doors in this town. Tomorrow I'm convincing Ava to buy a padlock. I'll stay out here and keep a watch. If we're in trouble, I'll uh, whistle. And at least you something. remember to lock this. Oh, sail on night crawlers. Me without my checkbook. 315 is pretty good, right? Well, I have no idea what I'm saying. 7-Eleven is highlighted. Huh. Okay. M-B? Okay, seriously, woman, are you trying to get your boat stolen? Eh, whatever. Gift horse, mouth, etc. I think all that leaves is the code for the lock so I can untie the boat. Which is probably 7-Eleven. Aw, happy birthday, Marco. <laughs> that is a lot of chocolate cake. Wait, M-B... Marco's birthday? Or oh, I thought MB was motorboat. But maybe they don't call them motorboats in America. <gasps> did, did you hear that? Dog, 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 dog. Athena? Athena! <gasps> Don't take his dog oh, away! Tina. You freaking knucklehead! Oh, I'm gonna kill you! Oh my god, I was so worried! Athena! You're okay, buddy! She seems alright. Is it okay if I pet her? Oh, let's find out. Athena, can Riley pet you? Athena, speak! <laughs> that means yes. <laughs> you know how many TV remotes this mud has obliterated? Oh, Athena, I swear to Vishnu, I'm getting you a bell. A very large bell that you can hear from Wisconsin. No more running off. Okay, seriously, this this is sweet. Maybe too sweet. Oh, for sure, but like, I needed this. 
real bad. Oh, man, this is... Oh, sorry. I'm uh, not usually like this, you know, but... Uh, it's been a long night. This is my home, you know? I get to pet a dog. It's just... It's nice to feel relieved. For once. It's okay, Jacob. It's all right. All right, come on, girl. I'll be right back. Like, right the hell back. So don't you wiggle away. You hear me? Be my good girl. Stay here. Sound good? Speak. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> I have to do this thing. It's an opportunity to do something important. And, uh... If I don't make it back, it's not because I didn't try. The one in town will take you in. They all know you. You'll, uh, you'll be okay. Oh. Okay. His dog okay. wasn't the dog that the radio right. guy was talking about throwing off a chasm. You think you know the code? Seven eleven. Seven one. One. Ta-da. Hey, nice work. Okie doke. After you. Ladies first. Age before. Ooh. Um. Mm. Yeah, after you. Uh, hey, come on. Get on. Jacob, I really... I think you should stay here. What? <laughs> no, I'm... What? <laughs> Riley, what are you doing? Why wouldn't I go? Look, Jacob, you should stay with Athena. What we're doing, what I have to do, it's... This is unacceptably dangerous. My conscience is already well below sea level. I'm not adding getting a guy killed who was just trying to do a job. Okay? No, not okay. Riley, we have the same job. Just get on the boat. This is stupid. Riley. Please, Jacob, just go take care of your dog, okay? You found her. That's... Just take the win. Riley, come on. I'm going. Why pretend I'm not? You're gonna need my help. I, my dog will be fine. Really. I'm not gonna say either. Well, if you're not gonna say anything, then... Then fine, fine. I, I won't be a... whatever. Our specter wishes. <laughs> I guess I just thought... I don't know. So I thought we you were can take him this. or leave him? I thought... forget it. Is it an actual decision? I didn't... I didn't want it to end like this. This is because of the gingerbread story, isn't it? I know I shouldn't have told you about that. No, come on, man. We're friends. We're just at the end of our night. That's all. Last call had to come sometime. Oh, it's been, uh... It's been. I'll see you off. Right? Of course. I'd like that. Come on. Hey, okay. Riley, you're uh, going to be a good mom one day. Whenever that happens. Thanks, Jacob. So next time we'll we'll take him. And thankfully, I don't have to actually steer the boat. Oh, 